What is the profile of our emotional life as we age? Despite the image of older people as cranky or resentful of the young, Lara Kirstensen, a researcher of aging at Stanford University, shows that our daily emotional experience is actually mm -hmm, with age. Typically, older people experience more positive emotions than negative ones in daily life. The experience isn't purely happy. Rather, our emotions grow richer and more complex over time. We experience more mm -hmm, of positive and negative emotions, such as those poignant occasions when you get a tear in the eye at the same time you feel joy, or feeling pride at the same time you feel anger, a capacity we call emotional complexity. This mixed emotional state helps us avoid the dramatic ups and downs that younger people have, and they also help us exercise, exercise more control over what we feel. Mixed emotions are mm -hmm, to manage than purely positive or purely negative emotions. Thus, emotionally speaking, life just feels better. Better control over emotions and increased complexity means more enriched daily experiences. People with more emotional complexity also have a longer health span. Poignant What is the profile of our emotional life as we age? Despite the image of older people as cranky or resentful of the young, Laura Carstensen a researcher of aging at Stanford University shows that our daily emotional experience is actually enhanced with age. Typically, older people experience more positive emotions than negative ones in daily life. The experience isn't purely happy, rather, our emotions grow richer and more complex over time. We experience more mm, co-occurrence of positive and emo negative emotions such as those poignant occasions when you get a tear in the eye at the same time you feel joy, or feeling pride at the same time you feel anger, a capacity we call emotional complexity. This mixed emotional state helps help us avoid the dramatic ups and downs that younger people have, and they also help, it, uh, help us exercise more control over what we feel. Mixed emotions are harder to manage than purely positive or purely negative emotions, thus, emotionally speaking, life just feels better. Better control over emotions and increased complexity means more enriched daily experiences. People with more emotional complexity also have a longer health span. Enhanced and co-occurrence and harder. Number six, towns and cities in developing countries are unable to provide housing, infrastructure, and services in pace with their population growth, which is typically much faster than, than it ever was in Europe. The result is unplanned slums without basic services, where conditions are miserable. This encourages politicians and donor agencies to regard your urbanization as negative. But the growth of slums is neither an inevitable consequence of urbanization, nor can it be blamed only on the lack of financial resources. Slums are also the products of failed policies, bad governance, inappro inappro inappropriate legal and regulatory frameworks, unre unresponsive financial systems, corruption, and not least, a lack of political will. Some governments even compound the problems by limiting access to land and services for low-income migrants. Even more. But policies focused on stopping immigration or compelling people to leave urban areas, even though mass, even through massive evictions, are effective. This hounding of the poor has instead made their life even harder. Eviction. Uh, a lack of political will. Some governments even compound the problems by limiting access to land and services for low-income migrant migrants. What is compound? But policies focused on stopping Im stopping migration or compelling people to leave urban areas, focused on stopping migration, or compelling people to leave, 강제 퇴거를 하거나 even through massive evictions, are effect ineffective. This hounding of the poor has instead made 
their life even harder. Compound는 뭔지 모르겠지만 일단 effective는 아니니까. Seven. Is value neutrality? Uh, is value neutrality possible? Many sociologists believe it is impossible to set aside personal values and retain complete objectivity. Objectivity. They caution readers, rather, to understand that sociological studies may, by, necess by necessity, mm -hmm, a certain amount of value by us. It does not discredit the results, but allows readers to view them as one form of truth rather, tr one form of truth rather than a singular fact. Some sociologists attempt to remain uncritical and as objective as possible when studying cultural institutions. Value neutrality does not mean having no opinions. It means striving to mm -hmm, personal biases, particularly overcome personal biases, particularly subconscious biases when, ana when, analyzi when analyzing. Analyzing data. It means avoiding us avoiding skewing data in order to match a predetermined outcome that aligns with a particular agenda, such as political or moral point of view. Investigators are ethically obligated to report results, even when they mm -hmm, contradict personal views, predicted outcomes, or confirm. Investigators are ethically obligated to report results, even when they con mm -hmm, predicted out con contradict personal views, predicted outcomes, or widely accepted beliefs. Uh -huh. So, it is value neutral. Is value neutrality possible? Many sociologists believe it is impossible to set aside personal values and retain complete objectivity. They caution readers, rather, to understand that sociological studies may. They they caution readers, to understand that sociolog sociological studies may. Contain a certain amount of value bias. Okay. Let's contain and overcome, and contradict. Number eight. Technology does not exist in isolation. It emerges out of specific economic, social, and political contexts. But technological change can make certain things possible, or more or less likely. Technology was no threat to newspapers in the 1980s when computer typesetting and direct input revolutionized the industry, transforming the economics them in direction of huge potential increases in profitability. The new technology era allowed for enormous growth in the size of newspapers pagination pagination with the resultant potential for shrinking advertising revenues. Shrinking the current digital revolution allowing for the delivery of words, pictures and sound through screens and a vast limitless increase in the amount of information available through this medium is of course a challenge to newspapers, but not necessarily a terminal threat. It is that challenge newspapers are addressing now in various ways with varying investment and varying creativity, varying creativity and Im imagination. There is undoubtedly a lot of gloom to be found in newspaper offices these days, but that is not the whole story. It also it is also an exciting time for newspapers. Newspapers are not on death row. So, technological change can make certain things possible or more or less likely. In Drake when computer typesetting and direct input revolutionized the industry, got the um, that new technology era allowed for innermost growth in the size of newspapers, pagination. 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 Pagination, maybe. With the resultant potential for Shrinking advertising revenues, expanding advertising revenues. Okay, this one. 
5, 6, 7, 8. 5번은 exercise. 5번은 아, 5번에 2번이야. 6번에 5번. 7번에 3번. 8번에 3번. 그러면 5번에 Mixed emotions are easier to manage than purely positive or purely negative emotions. Easier? Is it really easier for that? As emotionally, emotionally speaking, life just feels better. 음, 이게 기분이 더 낫다는 거지. Easier. 알았어. Cranky appointment. 그래서 모르는 단어는 음, 모르는 단어를 찾아보자. Decreased, rather, separation, negative, and poignant. 오늘은 패드. 여기 여기서는 compound 그리고 그 뒷장에서는 contain, exclude, skew, line, line 모르는 단어까진 아니지만 음, 그리고 그 다음에 pagination 이렇게 단어 네 개를 몰라 그러면 포인트는 가슴에 사무치 내. 컴파운드. 컴파운드는 어디서 나왔지? 여기서. 그러니까 평소에 알던 뜻 말고. You can compound the problems by limiting access to land. 문제를 더 심각하게 한다는 건가? 오, 그러네. 악화시키다, 심각하게 만들다. Or 섞다, 혼합하다. 혼합하다. 페이지네이션 페이지를 매기는 게 진짜 페이지네이션이야? 그러면 페이지네이션은 진짜 페이지네이션이 그건가 봐 언니 껌딱지 언니 껌딱지 수금아 펭구 펭구 어디있어?